I'm John Russell, and I was given the Hertz Fellowship in 2012. Uh, they've got that the slogan to freedom to innovate, and I think it's a um, it's a wonderful group of people who just naturally have their brain uh, going in many directions. Uh, we were just talking this morning about how uh, the Hertz Fellow is kind of a a special type of person whose thinking is very convergent and divergent at the same time, where you're able to focus on something if you really want, but all the time your thinking is going in many directions. Um, so I think I, I tend to focus on there. I tend to exhibit more of the divergent thinking a lot. So, uh, uh, but I, I think it's a it's a wonderful community. Uh, one of the questions that was really funny was um, they, had, they had said, "Okay, so if you have a vial of purple goo." Um, if I give it to you, what can you tell me about it? Like, what would you do? And so I was like, okay, gosh. And I think of all of these chemical techniques, all these spectroscopic techniques I could use to maybe like think about it. And they kept asking me, but like, what's what's special about it being purple? Like, what why what would you do if it was purple? And and I said, I was like, I don't I don't know where they're going with this. What would I do? And I was like, well, are you saying it might be red and blue put together? <laughs> it was a really dumb dumb comment. And they're like, no, I think we're going for you know UV vis spectroscopy. I hadn't mentioned it and. Uh, I felt really stupid after that, but uh, it was funny. It was really funny. Whole universe, yeah. Microbes are amazing. I uh, obsessed with it. It's it's a it's a veritable jungle of a world. And we can't see it, but you can you get glimpses, you know, in the microscope and what you can imagine. Uh, but it's it's a real diversity of life, and it's something that I think we're beginning to appreciate more and more, and uh, especially in terms of. Uh, the environmental presence of microbes, something we can learn to protect and conserve because we have a lot to learn from them for sure. So.